Hello there and welcome to another The Hunter Classic gameplay video. My name is Wimp and in this video I am here on Valdez Boys to do a round of pistols only. So if we have a look in my inventory you'll see I'm carrying only pistols other than the callers and actually I, <laughs> I had to get rid of almost everything else. So as you can see I've got the two uh, more powerful optics, but I had to get rid of the uh, range finder, the smaller one, rather than the binos. Uh, and I, I have nothing else other than every single pistol and the ammo to go in them. And the four callers for the species on this reserve. So, oh, and clothing wise, I am in a mix of summer field and summer forest. Now, I did take the one off my face so I'm just going to put that back on real quick if I can find it I believe it was that one and uh, I will show you my plan although it's not particularly special so my plan is to go up to the tree stand then head this way and then I'm going to do a river run basically and see what we can find now if by the time I've got down here, I still have pistols that I need to get a kill with because I'm planning to get a kill at least with every single pistol. If I still haven't, then I'll probably come up here, maybe then fast travel back to the lodge and maybe do something like this and check in here. I'm not entirely sure, but we'll see where uh yeah we'll see where i am when i get down into the south uh obviously almost all of these pistols are going to be loud so that's a little bit worrying oh and also as some of you may know i have little sayings that i like to say when i'm using pistols it's just a funny quirk that i think is funny and quirky so some of you will probably recognize them a couple of you may have heard them in other videos before this will be the first video obviously of mine where all of them are said in one video um and yeah as some of you may recognize them i have had to take a bit of liberty with some of them you might see what i mean when i get to them but yeah i i've changed them and tweaked them a little bit right so that's the plan i happen to have the 45 the 308 and the uh the hand crossbow already in my hands so i will see you when i come across something that i can shoot with them i mean that's the, one of the reasons i'm here on val de bois actually is because it, it actually <laughs> it probably isn't unique now that i think about it i'm sure every reserve has animals all the animals on each reserve can be shot by all of the pistols but you know i i don't normally come here so that's the other reason i thought i'd do this right so hopefully i will see you soon or sooner okay and we've already got the call of my first animal it was a female but there is a doe up on the ridge above me so i'm going to try and get up there oh it's been a while there, I think there's a boulder nearby. Oh, is it that one? I don't know. There, there, I'm pretty sure there's a boulder and some grass, leaf, bush, shrubbery type stuff that I normally get up here. But I'm not sure if it's over here. I mean, there's clearly no boulder here, but this looks walkable. Anyway, so I'm going to go up here. Do a squeak on the old roe deer caller. Oh, and then what I might do is go back to the lodge and replace the roe deer. Well, I might need to get another kill on a roe deer, but we'll see. yeah. I can at least get rid of the gun. You're another female. So there are two females. Right here then. Uh, this one? No, this one. Yeah. Now... Like I said, I've got a mix of field and forest. So I'm going to do a squeak and then hope I can find somewhere where my camo works. Uh, 
I might do a squeak here and then go up there, commentary. Now, I'm hoping there's a male with them, but I'm not too fussed if there isn't. I'll, I'll take a female all the same. So I'll see you when they get here. Okay, I do believe I have a rodo inbound and not a buck. And I'm going to take her with 308. Stand and deliver your money or your life. Quack! <laughs> Quack! You're a deer, not a duck! Right. Let's pick her up. She obviously isn't going to score anything. So right. That's that one done. I'm going to head back to the lodge, get rid of the 308. Bring out the scent spray and that other rangefinder that I like to carry. I am going to still go to the tree stand because sometimes there's rabbits and grouse in the area. And uh, the rabbits will have burrowed and the grouse, if I remember right, they don't run very far. So that's the plan. I will see you when something else happens. Yes, here's where I normally go up. And that's the bush that I went up next to earlier on. Yeah, I was that close. <laughs> oh well. Oh, and also, if you, in case you care, I've managed to get not only the scent eliminator and the uh, rangefinder back in my inventory, but also my first aid kits and a camping supply. <laughs> so hooray. All that for the weight of one pistol. Well, and it's ammo. Well, right, see you in a bit. There's a rabbit just in front of me, so of course I'm going to use the 2 2. You get a Series 4 D atomizer, and I get this little midget cricket. fucked at the timing because I accidentally <laughs> I accidentally unscoped but never mind <laughs> okay so that wasn't the one I was following but I got lucky there were rabbit in the area rabbits rabbit 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 1500 how does that compare no F near <laughs> did I hear another one much searching later. Okay, well, I haven't found any more. So, I mean, I found burrows that I hadn't seen the first time round. One there, and there's also one right up on the road. I can't remember, I think it's just behind here. But, uh, yeah, no rabbits. And, uh, of course, I've got lots of things to kill, so I don't want to waste too much time going after another kill with the same pistol. So, I'm going to head off and see what else I can find. Actually, I'm going to... No, I won't bother going back to the lodge. Not not yet. I'll get a tent on the way past or something. Right, oh, see when I find something else. Another rodo on the dot. This time I'm going to use the 10 mil. Again, I'm hoping I'm going to use the squeaker and a buck will come, but you never know. Right, so I think I'm going to use the squeak here and then go over there. Plan. Commentary. Two hours later. Rodo arrived. Ten mil time. I'll wait for it to stop. Okay. You always were an asshole, Gorman. Wah, 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 wah. What, 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 what was that? What, what, run away? What, what, wah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Uh, right, on then, let's go pick her up. That's the 10 mil done. Run, yes. <laughs> oh, and clear the red dot. Might as well. Oh, 
already max tracking for the rose, so I don't need to pick up her tracks. Right, well then, I'll see you when I come across something else for a different pistol. Right, as you can hear, there's one of the does still in the area, cracking away. But I can also hear a bear. I haven't seen it yet. Definitely hearing it breathe. Ah, there's the one that was quacking just now. Yes, I know it's a bark. And IRL, I, I have been on the YouTubes and listened to what they sound like. in real life and they do sound more like a bark IRL it's obviously something to do with the either the compression of the sound effect or the recording of the actual animal I don't know why in the game it sounds more like a quack than a bark but there you go there there you are you're over there Get the spot on it, and then I'll shoot it with the 45. Uh. Okay. I don't think it's funny, you laughing at my mule. Oh, there's more than one bear. Okay, she went that way and it looked like a fairly decent broadside shot. So I'm going to dot over there, but I am going to go to where I shot her, which is there. Alright, I'll see you when I find its body. Unless I shoot the other one, maybe. Well, that's annoying. The game is considering that a body shot. I have a feeling I'm about to be charged. Where is she? There. I don't think it's funny you're laughing at my mule. I don't think it's funny you're laughing at my mule. <laughs> Yeah, trying to say the little saying before, before you get charged at by a charging animal. Yeah, that was not fun. Ah, oh, she's given the rock a cuddle. Much like The Undertaker did at WrestleMania 40, anyway. Uh, two hits? Wound time five minutes, so it definitely was the one I fired at. Okay, well there we go. That's the 45 done then. Now, there is a tent over on the island in front of me. I think it's an island. Or am I on an island now? It's an island. Okay. So I am going to go there and just sort out the guns I've already fired with. Um, I'm going to bring... So I still have the muzzle-loading pistol to do. But I only brought the 45 caliber copper. Is that them? No. Is that them? No. No. <laughs> yeah, let me guess. They're, they're off the bottom. Um, Devs, why can't we scroll this? I mean, I know it's not normal to fill this up. But it would be nice if we could actually scroll down. Anyway. Oh. Yeah, there's the inline. No, that's that. So, yeah, the rounds must be just in. Anyway, so, yeah, I think it's the 45 copper. And those are the ones I brought. So I'm going to go get the 50 as well. Because there are other bears around. And I can't use the 45s on them. Which is stupid. Because I just shot one with a 45. So, 45 is fine. But 45 
copper from a muzzle loader. No, no, it's not fine. Anyway, moan. <laughs> See you in a bit. Why? Why am I crouching? Right, yo. Then the call of a red deer stag over on the island where the red dot is. So let's call him over. <coughs> Oh, there he is, but I can also see a white thing that's probably just a rock. It's a rock. Okay, he's coming this way already. I'm going to use the 454 on him. Up to two tans, so not brilliant. <laughs> I am a fire in my hand cannon! Boom! Yeah, I made that one up because I couldn't really find one better for the 454. Oh well, it's, it's done now. No, I wanted his third track. Never mind. What does he actually score? 186. Boo! A hundred away from what would be nice. Never mind. Alright, well that's that one done. I'll see you when I come across something else. Uh, so, foxes from here down. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, I might see if I can find that male bear that we saw over here. Although, I've probably just made it run away again. Uh, maybe another red deer stag would do. And bear. And male bear. A bear boar. And I'm pretty sure it's the same one I saw over here. I mean, it would make sense that it went this way. Because the score's the same. Now, the problem is, of course, I need to get across the water without spooking it. And water is noisy. Especially when you can't duck walk through it, developers. Moan. Ding. Yeah, he's less than a hundred meters now. Okay, I was able to crouch, commentary. <laughs> so, if I can get within range of him, I will be using the muzzle-loading pistol on him. Okay, good. Camo. Camo. Not working. Camo working. Oh, thank you, game, for letting me up on the rock. Oh, he's there now. Distance. Yeah. Within range. Ten years you carry their pistol, and now you waste your shot. Barbosa. Oh, is he dead already? Uh, did the sunglasses trick? Can't see his dome. Do I get spotting info? Yeah, I get an outline. You fell over. So he might need another one to finish him off. Okay. Just a body shot, apparently, but he's collapsed from it. Ten years you carry a pistol, and now you waste your shirt. I no, I don't need to reload. Ray right, dead, and that's the muzzle loading pistol done. Oh, <laughs> uh, what? I mean, I'm aiming here. Both times I... 
Okay. 22.1. Meh. Alright, cool. So, it looks like we got the hand crossbow, the 357 and the 44 left to go. So, I'll see you when I find something else. Welcome back. I'm standing on Fox Tracks 16 to 23 for a male. But I got the call of a grouse up ahead. So I'm going to call the grouse to here and then hand crossbow it. Or at least that's the, <laughs> that's the plan anyway. There he is. Uh, oh, he's there. Welcome to Transylvania. <laughs> you cheeky son of a bitch! <laughs> Did you fucking see that prick? He was lying down then and he stood up. <laughs> Just as I fired the crossbow, and the crossbow hit the ground underneath him. Oh! I, I saw him running. He was. There's more than one! Okay. I don't believe that. I mean, I could be wrong, and it might have been slightly short, but it did seem like it hit the ground underneath him because he just stood up. Do you know what? I might kind of go after him just to teach him a fucking lesson. <laughs> he does seem to be coming back this way. Did he fly away again? I haven't seen him fly. No, he's just having a flat. Oh, <laughs> God, be kidding me. And he's running as well. Oh, but yet again, he's running back. Because he's bounced off the water. Welcome to Transylvania. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, now that that's done, I shall go after the fox. Please get the bird, thank you. A 5,301. Yep. Okie dokie, let's go find the foxy. Right, still following the fox. That's his next track. But this guy's here, so I might as well. Welcome to Transylvania. <laughs> and I don't know if you saw them, but there's four hens just there. Five hens. Six. One. Well, yeah, six. <laughs> the lucky boy. Right. Now, the problem was I didn't want him fleeing. And scaring off the fox. But I have a funny feeling that he may have just been spooked anyway. Alright, let's go get this grouse and then carry on after the fox. Right then, let's see. A 5,500 grouse. Oh, just under. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so hopefully I'll see you when I catch up with the fox. Right, 
The fox should be up ahead. You can see his next track dome there, but I don't want to crawl forward and pick it up because that big boulder there will block my view. But I've done some squeaky squeakies on the caller. Hoping that it'll turn him round and bring him back. Okay, I changed my mind. I am going to pick up his next track. Because it doesn't seem to be coming. Uh, he might be out of range. Oh. Okay, it's possible he came to the call, saw me and ran. Yep. <laughs> Although it's funny how he saw me and I didn't see him, especially because I was looking up there, but... Eh. Fleeing. Oh! So, he's not going to get up that rock face, is he? So I might just stay here for a bit wait a while for him to calm down and then do some more calls. Plan! Welcome back. I've given up on the fox I was following because as usual being skittish it kept fleeing. But there's one. One for the 357. So I'm going to call it over, make sure it's running this way, and then go find somewhere where I can take the shot from. Let's turn this way slightly. Okay. Do you need a count? Nah, sir. Hey, hey, hey! Wabby! Promoted! Buster Scruggs Croft! There! Over there! <laughs> uh -oh. Right. Yeah, good. Got the blurred. Um, it was a male, 25, meh. I mean, it could be worse, I've had like 19 or something. But... Okay, that's the 357 done, just the 44 left. I have a plan. And I think you know what the plan is going to be. <laughs> I'm going to pop on, well, I'm going to replace the field camo with the Alpine. And use the 44 on the Ibex as the last kill. So I'm going to get dressed and I'll see you when I get there. Right then, I've made it to my favourite Ibex tripod stand. Oh! <laughs> okay. You just saw on the hunter make the rings dissipating, but that's up there somewhere. Now, this appears to be a female, but... Oh, and a red deer shed. You mean you have to use your hands? I really do hope that by some coincidence, the people who played those characters aren't watching me. Sorry. <laughs> uh. Oh, and by the way, I've not been, or apart from, I gave one away, the last one, I think. Uh, yeah, I'm wondering if people are going to be in the comments trying to guess or 
telling other people where these quotes are from. You mean you have to use your hands? You mean you have to use your hands? <laughs> Just fucking die! I mean, yeah, yeah, hands or something. My god, it's 44 caliber, not fucking. I, I don't know <laughs> where I go with that. 0. 0.17? There you go. Yeah, it's a shame they would doze, though. Those do, 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 those do. Have you finished sliding? I think you finished sliding, haven't you? Okay, so let's go get her, and then I'll go after the one I shot first. Ah, so there is a buck in the area somewhere. That way. Uh Okay, whatever. <laughs> hmm, should I go after the buck? Actually, no, I can't be bothered. <laughs> right, oh, let's go get the other one. Ah, there she is, over there. <laughs> My god, I, I think I found the tracks now of three males, and yet the only ones visible were does. Moan. <laughs> right, oh, then here we go. Oh, this is a buck. Ah, it's a buck. It's just a shit buck. That's why I assumed it was a doe. 127 is not very good at all. <laughs> yeah. Uh, also, there are ptarmigans around. Not that anyone cares, but some over there and some in the forest in front of me. Right, oh then, so now that I've got a kill with every single pistol, I'm going to call it the end of the video. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you got some enjoyment out of it. I kind of did. I enjoyed this one. And hopefully I will see you in another video. So thank you again. And goodbye. <laughs>